Well, so many times here on 7 News, we bring you stories that involve a grieving community. Well, tonight, we are very much part of that community as we mourn the loss of two extraordinary journalists in the Western Carolinas who died yesterday after a tree fell on their SUV while they were covering the severe weather. And I really had the honor of working with photojournalist Aaron Smeltzer for nearly seven years before he joined WYFF. We had become very close friends, and he was so excited to work with anchor and reporter Mike McCormick, who had a reputation as both a great journalist and a great guy. Today I spoke with his close friends and family about the men that we were so honored to know. In many ways, Aaron Smeltzer and Mike McCormick shared so much in common. They loved their life's work. I am live with you in Spartanburg outside. They were known not just for their talent and professionalism, but kindness. Our photographer Aaron getting some video of some of the customers here. And yet they had only just started working together four months ago. Outside of work, Aaron Smeltzer was a kid at heart. He edited this video. Perhaps the natural sound of his life story. He brought so much joy to the people he loved, especially his fiance, Heather Lauder. And we just look forward to spending time with one another. We loved each other's company. Um, I truly think he was my soulmate. Heather and Aaron were set to marry this year, even close on a house two days from now. I want you to know that I love you dearly. So many people in the community knew Aaron um, as the photojournalist in the area. Um, but he was just such a kind-hearted guy. Mike had worked in the upstate for 14 years. One big reason he never left was his longtime partner, Brian Daly. You just instantly felt their love, and they just adored each other. And so some people don't ever get that in a lifetime, and I'm so glad that the two of them had, had that for as long as they did. Mike grew up in Florida, was known for his stellar Halloween parties, love of cooking, and raising rescue dogs. Aaron used to curl up with his own dog, Diesel, to watch his favorite sport, WWE, or talk to his mother, who he loved dearly. In our years working side by side, he had taken home two Emmys and was nominated for yet another this year. Two passionate journalists, two gentle souls. Mike is everything that anybody would want to be. He is genuine and gentle and kind. Who will never be forgotten. He absolutely loved photography and doing videos. And that brings me peace knowing that he died doing what he loved. And we've checked with both families and funeral arrangements have not been set yet. Of course, we will let you know when they have a beautiful tribute, Diane. Thank you. We'll be right back.